Hey guys, what's up? It's Marty here back in the saddle once again, this time with a brand new or newish party game for Nintendo Switch, which we think might be uh, great for families, and we're going to test it out here for you and give you a first look. This is actually a Rabbids party game that was originally released in China to celebrate, I believe, Year of the Monkey. Um, and now it has made its way over here to uh, the Western Shores, uh, thanks to Ubisoft and Ubisoft Chengdu Studio. And we want to thank them for giving us a review code to check it out. This is a Mario Party style game that actually has a story that you can play along with. Uh, and all of the rabbits are dressed up in like traditional Chinese character garb, like uh, you'll see. It's it's very, very Chinese, uh, which is not a bad thing. Not a bad thing at all. Uh, and it looks like, oh yeah, we cannot play this with a pro controller. So I'm going to stick a Joy-Con here. There we go. You can only play it with a sideways Joy-Con. I'm going to see how this works out. Okay, we've got one controller, one player. Normal mode is still a challenge. Nightmare difficulty. Why don't we just do normal? That's fine. That'll work. And there's a story here at the beginning of how the rabbits were reading a book or a pad or something. And the Monkey King shows up. He learned various skills and did many enchanted items, all of which shaped his destiny and allowed him to become a god of the celestial empire. But it all fell apart. The Awakened One imprisoned him under the Five Finger Mountain. Five hundred years later that he was rescued by Tripitaka, they traveled west where they met Pigsy and Sandy along their journey. Together they overcame many trials and tribulations before arriving at Mayin Temple. To receive the enlightenment from the awakened one. And guess what? Their rabbit's magic time machine is going to take them to this area. Suddenly, a bright light flashed across the sky. It was a Suds Queen 5000 washing machine. Amidst the chaos, the sacred books fell to the land of the living. Rabbits flooded from the washer, which had a large cubic foot capacity. Of course it did. The awakened one waved his hand. He trapped the washing machine under a magic bell. He sent the rabbits to the land of the living. Gather the sacred books. I will return your washing machine. All right, there's your basis for the story. Play games, get the books, get the uh, get the washing machine. So you can play adventure mode, which is the aforementioned story mode. Party mode, which just lets you play games. Player settings, game settings. Let's just jump right into adventure mode here. We have played a little bit. We'll just start a new game. How about that? And I like this guy, Rabbit Erlang. Or let's let's just see. There's a Rabbit Ape, Rabbit Tigerkin, Rabbit Red Monster, Crystal Beast. Oh, we're gonna be the Regal Bull Monster. There we go. And as you can see, there's other characters to unlock there, if you would like to as well. So we have to journey to the bell. We have to play games to get there. Hatch from stone eggs. All right. 
It's going to tell us how to play the game. Don't fall off the cliff. All right. Going for red first. Yellow seems to be the aggressor, at least, here at first. Oh, I'm going off. Nope. Oh. Red must think I really have it out for him. Green's off. Green's off again. Yellow's off. Green. Green's holding on. Uh-oh. I've yet to lose any... Well, there, I said it. Games can actually be pretty long, whereas unlike Mario Party, sometimes games are over in seconds. But this is an entire level, so you're going to get books based off your performance here. So let's see. Five books. Yeah. All right. Going to fly. Don't know exactly what that means, but we're going to do it. Hold your Joy-Con up like a plunger. Buttons facing you. Lift the plunger as close to the zero mark as possible. Oh, okay. I think I can do that. Ah, it was a little bit closer. Number four, I think, has got it. He's he's on point. I did this five times. Not bad. Pretty easy, though. Get another five books here. And now we're going to the open sea. We have left the Flower Fruit Mountain and we build a raft, okay? Ain't scared of spicy food.
Okay. Oh, hold it horizontally. Eat as many chilies as possible. I'm the eater. You cannot skip these tutorials. Oh yeah, I guess you can. So I literally just move around and catch chilies. Oh, and don't get hit with rocks. And then they fly away with a fart. That's fantastic. That's... New game unlocked. Alright, pulling the gold pillar. Dragon King. What will you do? Pulling the gold pillar.
This is interesting. Uh, this gets tiring after a while. There we go. Then we have to wait for them to get the rest done. Finally. Find more books for our quest and another mini game down. Guys, that's adventure mode. Party mode is the same thing. You just play games with an assortment of characters. You can play this as a team as well. I think this would be great if you have little kids, but I can't really see it holding kids uh, or, or adults' attention. The games are a little simple. Uh, and the cultural divide, while it's cool to have a different culture, it just doesn't really have give anything, unless you're really familiar with the source material, doesn't really give you anything to hold on to. It's a good try by Ubisoft, but Mario Party is still the king of Switch Party games, and I would highly, highly recommend it over this. Although, you may be able to find this one at a bargain, uh, either now or pretty soon. So guys, that is Rabbids, um, and we hope that uh, you will... Uh, enjoy it. Keep and lock it right here at Nintendo Dads for lots more news, reviews, previews, uh, all kinds of things uh, that we've got going on a podcast every Thursday night. And uh, you can see reviews like this for Rabbit's Party of Legends from us, Dads After Dark, um, and all the rest of the guys uh, right here on our YouTube channel almost daily. And so keep it locked right here for more news, reviews, previews, a podcast every Thursday and your audio are, are on here live. And then... Uh, in your audio device every Friday. This has been Marty for Nintendo Dads, and you've been watching Rabbit's Party of Legends. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.